Did you ever imagine that you would play in Israel against other top 10 tennis players in front of uh, 1,000 people in the crowd? This kind of thing? Uh, no, I actually haven't because yeah, I never know <laughs> if we're going to play here or not. Uh, obviously, if we would have played on the Israeli team, you know, we would be here, but uh, I haven't imagined that it's... I'm really glad that we came here, you know, we, we had our goal and we, we succeeded. We have spoken among us, the journalists, and we said that it, this was probably the best tennis match that we ever saw in Israel. Thank you. How was it from your side? I think it was a great match, you know, we showed very high quality of, um, of tennis and uh, it was tough conditions out there and uh, uh, Agnieszka is a very tough opponent, especially with Especially, especially with the wind, you know. Um, but I, I'm really happy with the way with the way I played, and uh, I, I hope a lot of people enjoy it. Can you describe the difference between last year Fed Cup and Portugal to what happened here? I think it doesn't matter where we play, we, everywhere we have a chance. We will give 100% and we see who's going to be the best this day. Yeah, I think it's the matter, you know, of, of our players because we know we, we come uh, uh, every day and we give our best. We're going to try to win every single match. Every, obviously, every single point is impossible, but we, we're going to try our best because we are, we are fighters in the court. Okay. Well, I, I, it's not my first time in Israel, so I kind of know what, what, you know, with the country. I heard a lot of girls were a little bit worried because of security here, but um, I think it, it, it went good. It's a little bit tough conditions, you know, it's different formats for everybody, but um, me, I'm honestly very happy that we passed this group and um, <laughs> it doesn't matter where it is. Right now. Your best uh, achievement so far in Grand Slam is the quarterfinals. What do you think needs to be improved in your game in order to go further in Grand Slams? Well, it's a little bit, you know, a different question when we're in Fed Cups. <laughs> um, but I have to work on my game. You know, it's always there's always room to improve and always step forward. I'm just excited that I have a lot of room to improve, so I'm going to work every single day and try to give my best. Uh, there, is a lot, there is a lot of uh, children that uh, learn in uh, uh, tennis school. Uh, I don't know really if uh, they know where is the Belarus situated, but everybody says now uh, Belarus, Victoria, and uh, just now uh, they can see what is tennis, uh, not on the TV only. What you can to wish to these uh, children? You know, I think the best thing to wish for children is uh, to believe, you know. Um, I'm glad that uh, a lot of players, a lot of top players uh, came here and showed um, to the kids the, the inspiration and uh, a little bit of... Uh, 
little bit of warm motivation to play, so I think it's, it's a great sport, and uh, if kids love to do it, you know, I just want to wish them good luck, but everybody knows how hard it, uh, it's hard work, but uh, you got to believe in yourself and uh, just play, enjoy. Uh, in addition to these questions, uh, how many confidence do you think this appearance should give you toward the uh, season in the personal uh, uh, it gives a lot, you know. It's it's. It, I'm really really happy with the the two pass because it's been a goal for for a couple of years. Uh, um, me, uh, every week is different for tennis, you know. Um, you, you can you can lose one tournament, there's always another chance. So, but it definitely gives me confidence, and I'm really excited about uh, about the year. I'm starting to feel my game much better than I did in Australia. So, I'm, you know, I'm excited to to see what happens next. How did you feel uh, with the Israeli crowd? I felt good, you know, there were a lot of supporters, so it's, it's nice when you, have, when you play a different country and there are still people coming and support you, so I, was, I just really would like to, to thank them, you know, for people who came, uh, because uh, we play for, for fans as well.